Hey, Billy. It's Dylan, but hey, Tiller, welcome to my house. Thanks, dude. Are you ready for the sleepover? Heck yeah. Hey, they're a uh, robot. Dylan, is that your Tiller friend? Yeah, isn't he cool? Yeah, hello there, Tiller. I am Dylan's mom. Hello, you already know my name. <laughs> is that your younger brother? Yeah, his name's Ollie. He turned three months old yesterday. He's so adorable. He sure is, but where's your dad? Dylan doesn't like to talk about it. It's okay, I'll tell him. He's not alive anymore. Oh? Yeah, he died in 9-11. Oh, crap. Yeah, on September 10th, the day before, my mom found out that she was pregnant with my dad, and then on 9-11, my dad needed to go to the Los Angeles for business reasons, but that was the plane that the terrorist hijackers flew into the World Trade Center, and then in 2003, I was born. Damn, sorry that I asked. It's fine. And you're 16? Yeah, 17 in a month. Ah. Wanna go to my bedroom and play Fortnite? Yeah. Damn, that was fun. Wanna watch some Stranger Things on Netflix? Yeah. I love this episode, so does Tyler. Yeah, it's my favorite too. What the hell? Oh no, an emergency broadcast. When did Netflix have that cable emergency stuff? It's something special with my TV. Oh. This is your emergency broadcast system. Timpson Wright, a highly dangerous criminal, has broken out of prison and is on the run. Hurricane Utah citizens, please lock your doors, and if you spot Timpson Wright anywhere, please inform the police immediately by dialing 911. Not Timpson! What about him? He's me and my friend's arch nemesis. Oh, damn. Back when we were alive, he murdered us and stuffed us into these robot suits. Jeez. We've always wanted pure revenge on him. We've given him plenty of revenge, but then Mr. Wright wants revenge then, and it's just an endless cycle. It's weird. This guy's probably insane. Indeed I am, teenager. Ah, uh, Timson Wright! Yes. Hello, Tiller. But I'm not here to kill you. Really? Yep, yeah, really. I'm only here to warn you that I'll try to kill you soon. Oh, no. The cops are on my ass, like always, and are trying to find me, so farewell. No, hey, leave my friend and his friends alone. Oh, you're going to be a smartass now, little kid. I don't know, just leave them alone, for the love of God. Kid, I'll bash your teeth in. No, you wouldn't, weakling. Arrgh! You're making me angry. Uh, dude? Good. Stop being a pest to society, you fool. Look, Fortnite child. I challenge you to a series of fights. We're at war with each other now. Good. When I'm done and win, I'll come after you next, Tiller. Farewell. I'll see you in the first fight in the morning. Farewell, ugly. Dude, do you know what you just got yourself into? Yeah, and I'm gonna win against that Fortnite hater. Dude, give him hell. Let me call Tyler and crew real quick about what's gonna happen. They'll support you. Alright. So, what are you gonna do first? Embarrass the hell out of him. Oh my god, yes. Just what is one of Timson's most personal secrets? Not really a secret, right? but you can insult him instead by his mask, for example, mate. Wait, is that a rip against me? Not really, mate. It's gonna offend Timson more than you. Alright. Alright, insults will do. Timson right? More like gay said right? He wears a mask because his face is too ugly that he wants to hide it. He totally roasted Timson. Yeah. He also gets arrested a lot because he's too stupid to get away with his plans and fails to murder Tiller, Tyler, and crew. He also has no life at all either. He wastes his time trying to get revenge or rots in his prison cell like a pathetic asshole. Timson's really stupid, bro. Yeah. So, that's how we're playing this out, huh? It's Timson, guys. Make fun of him. <laughs> yup. You smell like olive oil, like a piece of garbage. You're the biggest loser in my entire city. What, Mark? Mark, what the hell? What did you draw on me? 
a penis? Urgh, you assholes! Kid, it's my turn! Get wrecked, noob! Super ponage! Man, Timson's face under the mask was probably embarrassed as heck, but I don't care. <laughs> exactly, that lowlife can leave you guys alone now. You do know he said you'll get revenge on you for that. Case in point, look over there. No thank you for your pure money, Mark. You're welcome, Timpson. Say, are you too old to play a game like Fortnite? Nah, I'm a child on the inside. I'll never be too old for anything, ever. Right, nice business with you. Had to wash your 10 out of 10 drawing of yours off my mask. All right. What are you doing here, mate? Oh yes, this is my revenge. What is it? I did a bit of hacking and I got your Fortnite account information, email, and password. What? And then I made copy of cards with the info and I set up a little stand for it. Two dollars for a card of your Fortnite information. Dude, no! Bruh. Good if I have to be honest. Shut up, Tyler. Just saying. I just got a notification that someone spent all of my V-Bucks. <laughs> I'll get my payback. All right, smell you later. So what do you got plan to do? We're gonna break Chopper and Sperry. Oh geez, his axes are special to him. Oh please, he shouldn't worry about it. Well, Tyler names his van and treats it like it's special. But this isn't about Tyler. This is about Timson Wright. True, let's just get it over with. Here we go. <laughs> He's gonna be pissed. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> We should go now. He'll be home in an hour. Yeah. So that stupid kid broke my two axes, huh? I'm going to attack for revenge one more time. But this will be special. <sighs> Thanks for being there for me, Tiller. You're welcome, dude. You're awesome, and I don't know what I would do without you. Thanks. Yeah, I don't know what I would do without my mom and my baby brother, though, either. I already lost my father 19 years ago, and if I lost the rest of my family, I would be a mess. Yeah, me and your family will never leave you. Ever. Thanks, dude. My revenge shall be sweet. <laughs> I'm gonna declare a truce to Timpson. Say what? I'll be done trying to fight Timpson. That's good, but that was quick to declare, though. Yeah, I might. Don't worry. I, I made up this truce paper that I'll hand to Timson at this hill. Timson and then the citizens of Hurricane Utah are waiting. Interesting. Also, Timson said he prepared something for me too. Interesting. Timson? Ah, yes. Dylan. Hello. <laughs> I declare a truce. Oh, really? Yeah. Let me see it. Yeah, I don't want to fight you anymore. I want to leave you alone and go along with our days. Yeah, I declare truce too. Wait, really? Nah, I have a story and then a show to put on just for you and the town here. Huh. Firstly, get into that contraption now. Nuh uh. Get in! Alright, what is it? <laughs> What was the last thing you said to your mother and little Ollie last night? Good night. Well, let's just say it was a bad night for them. What do you mean? Shush, shush. I'll get there. Anyway, last night, I overheard you tell Tiller about how you would be a mess if the rest of your family was gone. Then, revenge came, and now here we are. <laughs> you didn't. Oh yes, I did. Might as well pay respects to your dead family. Oh wait, it's too late. What the actual hell? No! <laughs> yes! Your mom and baby brother are dead! <laughs> How could you? <laughs> oh, and want to know the next part? 
I brought a special guest. Who? Dad, is that you? Yep, it's him, but guess what? He's dead too! <laughs> How did you do this? Yes, the story about your mother and baby's brother demise, and how I got the corpse of your already dead father. <laughs> Firstly, I got the idea when you told that vital information to Tiller. Then when you two went to sleep for the night, I broke into the house and brutally murdered your mom and your brother. I slit your nagging mother in the throat with my knife and then stabbed the knife in her eye so she wouldn't see I was murdering her. Then Ollie, I threw that baby queer to the wall and stomped on him like a bug and then bashed his face with a brick. Then. I put your mother and brother into my body bags and moved them to the hill where we're, where we're currently at. Then, your father. I found out about your father through some notes in the mother's bedroom about his name and where he was buried. I found his grave and dug it up. I grave robbed it and took your father's body. I put him in another body bag and once again took it up to this, to this hill. About why I took your father, too. I brought him here so this next part will be more upsetting and torture for you. And what is that? I'm gonna eat your dead family right in front of you! I'll use this fork and take each piece of them and eat them one by one so you can never, ever, ever see them again! <laughs> no! Leave them alone! Leave them with my family alone, you monster! <laughs> yep, let's start with Ollie. I miss you, Mom and Dad, so much, and Ollie, too! <laughs> oh my god, Ollie's the most delicious thing I've ever tasted. Murder is the best. By the way, I also feed on your sweet little tears. <laughs> Yummy. <laughs> Timson. Dude, you're so insane. You murdered his entire family by eating the bodies? What the actual hell, Timson? This is the most messed up thing I've ever seen. Totally. I need to take variety in my Dylan family diet. Let's start eating bits of your father who's been dead for 19 years. Stop! <laughs> oh my god, so yummy! Dylan's family tastes so good. The rest of you guys should eat, but I have to tell you this too. What? I framed you for the murders! Officer Daniel should be here at any moment. The one in the machine is your man, officer. Thank you, Timson. Also, we decided to pardon you for figuring out a crime for us. Cops, arrest Timson! For what? You murdered your own family, and you're being arrested for that. I gotta thank Timson for the letter that you sent him, which totally isn't Timson's handwriting. What? So were your grandparents next on your murder list, kid? But I'm innocent! That's what they all say. <laughs> You're not going to juvie or even a prison. You're going to an insane asylum for what you did 
for a while, you distasteful psychopath. <laughs> Also, by the way, Dylan, Officer Daniel gave me an idea. I'll murder your grandma and grandpa next. So when you get out, have fun with no family at all. <laughs> I love my family so much, I miss them. <laughs> should have had those feelings before you did the crime. Get the hell in my car. I think Ollie's the most delicious one. <laughs> Guys, it's best to never mess with Timson ever again. Yeah. Agreed. Good call, mate. Actually, here's the lesson of the day. Be careful who you mess with in life. Period. Ah ha ha ha! Ah ha ha ha! Ah ha ha ha! Ah ha ha ha! Ah ha ha ha!